What's going on all rap fans from around the way? Hey listen, I got a brand new rap reaction for you right here, right now. This one's Lil Durk, J. Cole, it's called All My Life. And man, this is fire. I gotta make a confession to you. I already done this video, but I didn't press record. Oh, no way, man. Yeah, that happened. Anyway, I'm gonna do my best to do a second round, second time reaction for you. This is fire, man. You're going to love it. I love it. And I'm glad I'm doing it again, actually, because it's a hella tune. Let's get into it, man. Oh. Oh, man, this is like an anthem, this. You're going to love this one, man. Dougie, you told me he been on some positive shit. Yeah, yeah. Lately, I just want to show up and body some shit. Yeah, yeah. Always been a little mad petition. Lately, this cash I'm getting. Got me losing count of these bags. I've been moving too fast. Hard times don't last. Remember when cops are rat. Hard times don't last, man. You gotta remember that. You gotta remember that. If anyone's in hard times right now, they ain't gonna last. So good times are coming. Count of these bags. I've been moving too fast. <coughs> hard times don't last. Remember when cops are rats Talking out my ass. Boy, you ain't shit but a bitch with a bag. You ain't shit but a bitch with a badge, man. You gotta love that. And then the anthem's about to kick in, man. You gotta Talking out my ass, boy, you ain't shit but well, a bitch this. with a badge. All my life. They be trying to keep me down. All this time. Never thought I'd make it out. No, no. No. Hey, hey, man, right? I swear, I have only watched this once, man, and that's that's how catchy this tune is. This is how this is gonna take off, man, because I've watched this once, and I've got that little chorus anthem bit going, man, and it's stuck in my head. This is gonna be stuck in your head for days, man. I decided I had to finish, but the media called me a menace. I just said with the mayor and politicians, I'm trying to change the image. You can't blame my past no more, I come from the trenches. Some said I'd never be a superstar, but I know I'm different. No, no. I'm the voice, but the system. Mm, he's saying, man, he came from the trenches, he came from the ghetto. People said he won't be a superstar, but he knew he was different. He believed in himself, and that's what makes the big difference. You're believing yourself. Somebody says you can't do something, y'all gotta go out in there and show them that you can do something, just like this guy has done. Um, I mean, I only heard of him a couple of days ago on um, on Twitter, and somebody was saying, oh, these guys have made um, money out of looking like famous people. This guy uh, looks like Little Dirk. And I said, I mean, I was having a drink. I said, hey, I'm a little drunk too, but I'm not that famous yet. <laughs> That's just a little fun fact for you anyway. Pass no more, I come from the trenches. Oh. Some said I'd never be a superstar, but I know I'm different. No, no. I'm the voice, but the system mm. ain't give me a choice. Know some people that still undeployed. I know a felon who trying to get forward. Child support's your only support. For a visit, I'm going through court. Yeah, for some people, child support's your only support, man. It, it's hard, man. you got to look at that in both, both sides of the thing, man. And you make up your own decision on that. When the jelly was chaining me up, and you know that I'm famous as fuck. See how you gon' joke about stimulus, but they really had came in the clutch. I know some kids wanna hurt they self. Stop trying to take drugs, I refer to myself. Trying to better myself. Man, he's, he's, he's spinning from the heart of it. Kids, stop trying to take drugs, stop trying to hurt yourself. I'm always trying to level up and better myself. That's, uh, that's just good. Good advice to all the kids. Trying to better my health, but all my life, they were trying to keep me down. All this time, never thought I'd make it out. No, 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 all my life. First generation ghetto nigga, cold world, hello niggas, made it out of the city with my head on straight, niggas keep shooting up the let out, yo enjoy the pill, gotta get out, cause the shit that I spit out, is a cheat code, like I'm facing a Rico, and how a nigga put a hit out, ooh, it's a cheat code, and a Rico, how a nigga put a hit out, mmm, 
and another one, and, and another one. I got like a hundred of them, bout to lap niggas, so they think they ahead of me, but I'm really in front of them now. About to lap niggas, so they think they're ahead of me, but I'm really in front of them. Oh, because when you're lapping somebody, you like coming up behind them. So they're like, oh, yeah, he's behind us, but really he's, he's lapping them, man. Mm, I love that. Some of them fumbling they bad, fucking up the little crumbs that they had. A reminder to humble yourself, this shit could be gone in an instant. Me man, yeah, he's saying, man, when you're on top, you got to act completely humble, man, because any moment, you don't know where you're going to be brought to your knees and you're going to be born on the floor with crumbs, man, with nothing. So you got to be acting like, oh, humble and stuff. When you're on top of your game, because the minute it gets taken away, you're going to be the one right on the floor, man. I'm running long distance, all pistons, fine. I've been stuck between maybe retiring and feeling like I'm just not hitting my prime. These days, seeing rappers be dying way before they even get in their shine. I never even heard a little buddy to somebody murder a little buddy. Now I'm on the phone searching a little buddy name. That's true, man. A lot of these rappers, man, they don't get heard of until they get shot up or whatever. And uh, you don't hear of them. And then as soon as, like, they get shot up or something, the media's putting out a post, whatnot, and then people are searching him, and that's what he's saying here now. You know, he's never even heard of Little Buddy. And now somebody's murdered Little Buddy, and now he's searching Little Buddy. Ain't got a plan as tunes all day in my room. Think it damn, this shit wicked to get their names buzzing. Some niggas just gotta go lay in a tomb. And media thirsty for clicks. I got a new rule. If you ain't ever posted a rapper when he was alive, you can't post about him after he get hit. Yeah, man, that's true. If, if, if you're not bothered about him when they're living, don't start trying to. Don't start trying to get sales off them. Putting shit out when they're dead, man. That's just wrong on all levels it's simple it's the principle on any tempo i'm invincible don't even rap i just vent to you i'd rather that than an interview most days fuck them all see how he links that into the media like posting people after the dead that's why he's saying like listen i'd rather rap and spit to you than than sit in an interview because you know in an interview you can you can be in an interview for like an hour long they cut it down to a five minute section take it all out of context so he's basically saying, you know, he's painting the picture on the on the media how they, they they're quite wicked in ways, and that's why he's saying rather than doing an interview, he'd rather just spit to you what he's thinking. It's simple, it's the principle on any tempo. I'm invincible, don't even rap. I just fit to you. I rather that than an interview most days. Fuck them all like I'm going through a whole phase. Young niggas shoot out the whip like road rage. I pray all of my dogs they so paid, and the only thing to kill him is old age. Man. Again, with the media, they're saying they're shooting out the whip like road rage. You know? What an entendre there. And he's, then he's saying, like, and then he prays. Um, all, all, what was it? Basically, all the rappers get so paid. And the only thing that kills them is old age. Man, don't we wish this happened to this guy? That guy there, I got a signed gold album up there for. We could only wish for that, man. You, I rather that than an interview most days. <clears throat> Fuck them all like I'm going through a whole phase. Young niggas shoot out the whip like road rage. I pray all of my dogs they so paid. And the only thing to kill them is old age. All my life. They be trying to keep me down. All this time. Never thought I'd make it out. No, no. No. All my life. All my life. <clears throat> trying to keep me down. Wow, what a track, man. It's like an anthem, that man. It's so good. As I say, I heard it once. Heard it once, and just that hook stuck in my head, man. It stuck in my head for days. The only other thing I can say about that, though, is it's meant to be. Lil Dirk featuring J. Cole, but for me, J. Cole stole the track. I don't know about you. Um, you know, if you think different or if you want to agree with me, drop us a comment in the comment section because I want to hear your thoughts on that. You've heard my thoughts. I want to hear your thoughts. And you know, if you want to be here week in, week out, vibing with us, then you better be subscribing with us. And if you like this, man, show us love in the forms of a thumbs up. Yeah, man. <clears throat> and you know, if you want to be watching some more of my reactions as well, then hey, YouTube knows you better than it knows me. Then I know you. 
and uh, YouTube says that that video right there that just popped up is going to be the best one that for you to watch and you're going to love it man so go and check that out anyway man until next time you've been awesome I've been it's just say peace